Hi friends, in this video, now we will see about the Vue.js filters. So where we will use the Vue.js filters? Let's see an example here. In the previous uh, Axios uh, example, we will let's take that example only. We are showing the list of all the employees uh, data here. Now what we will try to do is, we will try to reverse this employee name. Okay, how we can do that one? Now, how we can do that one is, for example, uh, here we can do the employee name dot split of empty dot reverse dot join. We can do like this to reverse the user. It got reverse. But now what will happen is, if you want to use the same logic anywhere else or in either component, any uh, any other component, if you want to use it. Uh, what you have to do is again you need to copy the same logic and you need to place it everywhere but now tomorrow uh, the uh, the client asks uh, that one so don't display the employee name in the reverse order, uh, reverse order please display it normally means then you need to go in every place and you need to remove this all the code now we can uh, so that could be a painful and also the logic uh, now this could be a simple logic but tomorrow it, this could be this could be the bigger logic also that's why in these scenarios it is better to implement the filters how we can implement the filters now here how we can write is we can add the pipe symbol here and we can write the reverse okay now we need to write the logic in this reverse reverse thing so how we can implement is here we will go and here we will write filters okay we'll have an object we can have as many filters as we can now I will write reverse okay value reverse of value whatever the value you will be getting here and now, now what I will do is return return value dot split dot I will reverse that one and again I will join okay split what it will do is split it, it will convert each string into an array and it will reverse the array and again we will uh, make the array as a string now I will go here and if I refresh the same output you got the same output now if you want to capitalize the employee name again you can add the multiple filter again here you can use the you can use the another pipe here again you can add the capitalize again what we can do is here we can use the same capitalize and we can write the value and this value we can return the value dot to upper case okay now what we will see here see we will we are able to convert that one into reverse order and also we are able to make the employee name as a capital also but here one problem is there what is the problem is this reverse and capitalize is accounted for this only for this component only tomorrow for another component if you want to implement means again you need to write again these all filters you need to copy and paste it there again it is having the repetitive code what we can do is these are nothing but what we can say is this this type of representation of filters is called as a local filter so we are writing for the, only for the local based only we can write these filters in the global based also so that these filters can be used in the global means in any component in the project everywhere we can use this filter let's see how we can write that global filter let's take for example in the source i am trying to create one folder by name filter so that all the filters we whatever is useful for in this project we will create here only let's create only one filter for this demo reverse filter now what i will do is i will try to create a new folder reverse filter dot vue okay now what i will do is export default function of value i will take that value and what i will do is i will do the same thing whatever the app dot view is there I will copy the same here the code okay and I will paste it here sorry we need to rename this file as js file actually filters consist of only logic it is not the view template okay so reverse filter and app dot view what we can do is I can remove this all filter and what I will do is I need to import that file okay import reverse filter whatever the name you want you can give it from from where I need to import from filters I need to import filters and reverse filter I need to import 
okay what i will do i will i need to include that filters reverse filter in that filter list of filters so these are the list of filters that is used by this component now you can also make this capitalize a global filter also for the time being i will keep it this one as a local filter only now this reverse filter what i can do is i can copy and i can paste it there okay now what i will do i will try to refresh the code the same output we got the same output see for example if you want to see also you can change this one and i can change this one as high okay see all the employee names are converted into the high why because we are returning the high what is this one is doing it is sending this employee name to the reverse filter so that whatever the manipulation you want to make for this string you can make so this one will return the data and this data is again converted into the capitalized thing now what we will do here let's reverse the code and again it is making the reverse in this way we can use the filters as a global filter and also we can declare the filters as a local filters also if you like this video please sus subscribe to my channel and also if you have any doubts or anything please post the comments so that i will give you the reply thank you